tutorial on how to complete the Oryx Hard Mode Challenge. We're going to start with the Titan Perspective. Two Titans, one with Weapons of Light, the other with Blessings of Light, both with Bastion activated. In the beginning, we're going to kill the adds in the front, waiting for the Knights to spawn on plates 3 and 4 before killing those as well. Once all knights are down, we're going to move to the center. Looking to both pillars, we're going to stand facing the middle, waiting for Oryx to slam. We should visually see a shake to the screen or audibly hear him slam on the platform. Once that's done, drop your bubble. Wait for both buffs to activate. Slide out, DPS down, and kill Ogre 1. Sliding back into the bubble to refresh both buffs, kill Ogre 2. Again for three. And finally four. Once all ogres are down, the runner should have the spark. Slide back into the bubble. Wait for the runner to run towards you after picking up the aura from the vessel. At this point, you should be killing the adds, vessel, and any light eater knights that are left over before getting ready to stagger oryx. Once oryx slams on the platform, He'll open his chest, DPS to stagger. Our runner at this point would slowly walk forward so that we could kill any remaining adds in the front of the room before the shade phase that we'll get to in just a couple minutes. In the runner position, you can be any class. I was a warlock. After killing all the no adds and knights, you're going to follow Oryx to whichever plate he chooses, whether it be three or four. Oh, we're always doing it on this side. He's going to slam, then remove his fist, jump up onto the platform, Locked and become torn. Okay. Plate holders will then begin to build the platforms for you to jump in a counterclockwise pattern around the room. Once you get to the final spark, call out to your teammates Locks that you've it. achieved the relic. Run through the Titan bubble to gain blessings of life buff before heading to the vessel, yeah. slamming, and getting the aura. Immediately run back, back to your teammates and set up for stagger. Lady is down. Being in position. Come on, come on, Once Oryx slams and opens his chest, call right, out to your up. teammates Ready. to DPS for stagger. He's opening. He's open. He's open. Once Oryx is staggered, right, I'm just gonna then kill shooting. any remaining adds that anything. might be left in the room. Let me know when to start moving forward. You can now. Okay, here we go. Yeah. Slowly, back slowly. Back. After that, slide forward so that your teammates can kill you any remaining stop. adds. Going on. This is first plate position. Hunter, Tether, and Black Hole. Okay, here he goes. <clears throat> Follow Oryx yeah, to the three. first position. He's on three, four. He's Waiting four. for the runner to jump first before following. Follow the runner and begin to build the platforms. Throwing a grenade and DPSing down your That's ogre up. before turning, sniping, or rocketing your light eater knight across the room. Duck down to avoid any acolyte eyes. Wait for the runner to call out that they have the spark. Yeah, I got it. Tether the middle road, then head for the bubble. Awesome. Once in the bubble, achieve the blessing. Yeah, Wait for the runner, then DPS down any adds, vessel, and light eater, eater knights left. Good. He slammed. Get ready. Okay. Chest. Wait for the bubble to down. Okay. Next will be in plate two position. Oh, Move to the coming. second plate in order. There. Wait for the runner and first plate holder to be on their platform before jumping into position. Use up. 
What's Time's on up. the platform? Crouch and wait for your ogre to spawn before grenading and DPSing down. Then immediately turn and look for your knight. Snipe or rocket your knight down. Jazz has really avoid any damage and wait for runner to have the spark before heading back to the bubble. Grab your blessings of light. Come out. Finish off oh, yeah, any remaining enough. adds and light eater knights. Once all of those are down, wait for the call out to stagger. Right. Light eaters down. Light eaters are down on the door side too. Next will be in play three position, which should be your second hunter with tether and black hole. I can't even tell if I get anything Move to the third plate position. Wait for the runner, plate holder one, and plate holder two to call out that they're on their plates before jumping up. He's up. Once up, move to position to grenade down your ogre and DPS down. Once the ogre's down, turn for your knight, either yeah, snipe or right. rocket. At this point, the runner should have the relic. Immediately tether the middle road and head for the bubble. Getting weapons of light and blessings. Come out, finish off the adds and any remaining light eater knights. Right. Light eaters down. Waiting to turn and stagger. Light eaters are down on the We'll talk about the shade phase. Here we'll be in the position of one of the last to be teleported oh, right in. There. Immediately right, you should switch to red death is impossible. Look to the back of the room for any ads. Then to plates three and four for the knights. Knights are up. I'm in, watch out behind Once you guys. Once the knights are down, you will have spawns on the right side of the bubble one time on the right, two times Here on the go. left, 40, 90. and then two times on the right. Listen for your right. teammates 90. inside to call out Oryx's position and whether he's coming out to slam. He's gonna come out to play. Once it. teleported in, prepare to jump. Then look to Oryx to finish off DPS, then switching back from Red Death. This is Shade Phase again, this time as one of the first to be teleported in. Switch to Red Death again when possible. Here we go, switch Look to Red Death. for the ads in the front and the knights on plates I three and four. First. Nice. Once teleported in, look for Not orcs cool. or any adds that might have come in with you. Start to damage orcs and call out position of movements and whether he's coming out to slam. Come in. Snipers work best in this position. Also, you can use heavy machine guns. All the while, calling out position changes for teammates. Uh, whether he's coming out to slam for incoming teammates, not to be killed. He's coming out to play. Coming out. Just go back. Right time. Once Oryx is down, switch again from Red Death. In the last part here, we'll have the final run, all 16 detonations, and the last bit of DPS needed to finish Oryx off. He's going so again, to, uh, will go to he's going three, to, uh, three. Looks like here. We're going to wait for him to slam, then we're going to jump on and become torn. We're going to wait for the plate holders to start building the platforms. Yep. We're going to jump from platform to platform, platform. counterclockwise until reaching the final spark. Once at the final spark, we'll call out church. Okay, we have the relic. Go through the bubble. Get blessings of light. Head for the vessel. Slam and get aura. Immediately head back to our teammates. Yeah, the you guys are out of the bubble. 
Clearing ads. Vessel. He just slammed. And the final light eater ogres. Waiting for orcs to slam and stagger. Uh, uh, him. Now this time once stagger. Make sure you got the go last uh, light eater to that. Get last eater to get easy. Start a six right, second cool, cool, countdown cool, cool, cool. before sending ads. out the plate holders. Alright, this is so it guys. Detonate all six. Everybody knows where to go? Yeah. Alright, ready? Six. Oops, Plate holders Five, get to their detonations. Four, They're going to wait for three, each of their names to two, pop four times on the bottom left. Detonate. Once all 16 detonations are going to plate, they're going to come running back to the aura. Come back to me. And DPS orcs. At this point, his health should go from 100% to 1%. We're good. We're Once golden. that's done, he's going to appear at the front of the room. And everybody survived. He's going to open his chest, and we're going to go into the final DPS phase awesome. before finishing the fight. That was oh, man, really God. good, guys. What a night, you guys. I know. <laughs> We still have enough time to knock out those guys. Once his chest opens, just yeah, DPS do. as much as you can in this amount of time. And that's how you do it. Congratulations and thanks for watching. Oh, you guys.